dream of going to Wembley this season ended last night at the hands of their great rivals, Sheffield United, after 330 minutes of football. Now Barnsley have to lift themselves to avoid dropping into Division 2. The Blades' success story, though, goes on. It was never a dirty game, mainly because the referee got a hold of it very quickly. This is the first incident. Look, cross. Bad challenge, that. And he was rightly booked for that effort with Mark Todd. This was one of the best efforts in the first half from Barnsley. The cross comes over. Robinson's underneath it. Good save by Tracy. But I think you'll agree that uh, this next effort is surely the easiest chance any player will have in a whole season. Watch this appalling cross, picked up by Bradshaw. He must score, he must score. He doesn't. We're into the second half now. A spectacular effort from Cooper. So, after 90 minutes, it was Barnsley nil, Sheffield United nil. And you got the impression that one mistake was going to win this game or lose it. Here it comes. The challenge from Taggart is clumsy rather than malicious and a penalty was given. Look, none of the Barnsley players are protesting. Here's another view of it, taken just inside the penalty area. And a chance for Tony Agana to give Sheffield United that vital lead. Beautifully taken penalty. Ironically, Barnsley could have got back immediately. Free kick is taken. Now watch Agnew's roll on it. Gets the ball there, runs through. Tracy saves well. But it's Sheffield United who have the glamour tie against Manchester United in the quarter-finals.